Good morning. It's good to see you again, members of Trinity and uh, our members and friends, although obviously I'm not seeing you. These are announcements for March 29th, uh, the fifth Sunday of Lent. Now, let me just say that I record these on Friday because that's kind of as late as I can do it to get them uploaded to our YouTube channel so that Sandy can make a link into our worship uh, bulletin. But I realize that doing this today may mean that things have changed by next week. That happened last Sunday when we kind of encouraged those of you in the not risk at risk demographics to consider volunteering with Grace's Kitchen and the Second Harvest Food Bank. And uh, by Sunday, Grace's Kitchen had announced that they were not taking on new volunteers. And in the week, the Second Harvest Food Bank announced that they had suspended all volunteer shifts, uh, thankfully because the National Guard is now helping them in their building to prepare uh, pallets and meals to, to get out and meet the needs of those in our community that are hungry. At any rate, uh, please overlook it if anything I say uh, changes, but I don't think it will this week. Um, I want to say a word about connecting with one another. That's probably the most important thing we can do to maintain a sense of community. So my invitation to you is call, call, call. Call everybody that you think might need a call or benefit from a friendly voice. Be proactive in reaching out to members of the church and even neighbors in your community and let them know they're not alone with this. If you want to be more focused in that type of a ministry, we invite you to call Libby Williams. At the, um, she is our one of our Stephen Ministry leaders. I'm not going to give her number on a Facebook uh, or YouTube page announcement that could be accessed uh, widely by the public, but it's in your directory. So call Libby and join the Stephen Ministry effort to be keeping in touch with folks in our church. If you can't find her number, just call the church office and they'll be able to get your message to her. We've been trying to do a few things to keep you in touch. The pastors who have been involved in our Lenten round robin have been providing daily devotions. We hope you're receiving those and that they will uh, come to you uh, through the MailChimp mailing daily. We thank Sandy for being so on top of that to, uh, to get those devotions out. If she misses a day, please note it's not her fault. It means she didn't get an announcement uh, from one of the pastors. Something must have come up with them. But that'll be a daily uh, 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 way to just to keep in touch and provide a little spiritual focus. Uh, we are holding video FaceTimes with me on Tuesdays at 1030. That's the usual time for FaceTime with pastor. We're simply going to do it now on a Zoom platform. My apologies to everyone who tried to join us this past week, but could not get into the uh, meeting room. That was all my fault. Um, I'm new to this and I hit a button on my uh, Zoom page that said start, but it turned out that that only let me in the room. It didn't open the room to you, but we found out what that mistake was, so that won't happen uh, going into the future. So join us uh, via Zoom uh, Tuesdays at 1030. Bring your own coffee or your own tea, and we'll have any kind of conversation you would like. On Thursdays, also at 1030, and we're making the time the same as the video FaceTime, just to uh, lower confusion, uh, I am leading a Bible study. Uh, we had the first meeting this past week, we're going to be studying the Psalms. And each week we will look at least at the Psalm that is going to be heard the following week as part of our worship. So for next Thursday, it's Psalm 31, verses nine through 16. But we'll be doing more teaching and conversation about this rich resource of prayer and reflection that is ours in the scripture. There are other announcements that come out via the MailChimp. Uh, if you're on our email list, uh, please make note of those. If you're not, simply uh, contact us at 
T-L-C-E-L-C-A at gmail.com and we can easily add you to that list. God bless. And now, if you're watching these before our worship, let us worship the Lord.